Okay, today's product review is going to be on this trailer dolly. I got it at Harbor Freight. I want to say it was over $100, but then again, I want to say it was $75. I have no idea, nor do I care. Um, the only thing I don't like about it are the wheels. So this thing is supposed to be able to hold 1,600 pounds. Um... Okay, yeah, I, I, I move 1,600 pounds. I can see that because it's not all going to be tongue weight, but these tires on this tire do are on this little trailer dolly, these tires suck. They have, a, they have a rating on them that say 300 pounds. Well, that's 300 pounds a piece. So, you know, let's say that that is a 300 pound tongue weight. Well, I think it's like 150 per tire isn't that how they do that i think anyways i don't know um but i don't like these tires because even though i know i'm way under the tongue weight rating these tires get gooshy squishy and they are difficult to use but i'm going to show you how easy or presumably easy it is to move this trailer around Okay, you will notice that the fire pit and the fire tank are over here, and the generator is out of that door, and the power cord is put away. Well, I want to move the generator from that door to the back door, but I don't want to carry it, so I'm going to move the trailer instead. And I've shot this three times, and every time he's peed on that thing. Okay, so camp is pretty much well broken down. It's in Chuck the Wagon. Everything's cleaned up over there. So yeah. Okay, let's see how hard I can make this look. So I wanna move this trailer over here. Because when I back out, I want to back the track this way because of these tree limbs. The absolute first upgrade I would absolutely make is to get rid of those wheels. They're absolutely horrific. Um, I would go with a solid tire or something much, much denser. Those tires suck. So that's the first upgrade that I would do is um, those tires. I'm going to look for m more of a denser tire or a full rubber tire. Um, see how that works? Another upgrade. Um, it's a 1 and 7 eighths ball on there, which I like because that's a 2 inch and you don't need to lock it in place. You know, it, it can fit in there and I don't know. It depends on if the tires help the situation or maybe putting a two inch ball and locking the trailer on that. But uh, definitely need to change the tires. So I can hear two of them. Um, we're on the Cascade Mountain Range this side is the Rogue River Valley, that side is the Klamath Basin, 
and there is an Army Air National Guard station there. And uh, I don't know what they are, but you can they have that squall of fighter jet, so you could hear two of them. So this just happened. Yeah, it's time to go. Weather's not gonna get any better. If I'm gonna spin it inside, might as well spin it inside at home, right? Okay, as you can see, we're ready to go. Um, thanks for coming along. Sorry to cut this short, but the weather is the weather. Um, like, subscribe, favorites. Thanks guys, happy 4th of July.